Namaste. Welcome back to the trigonometric section. In our today's problem, we have LHS as 1 plus sin A plus cos A whole square. And on the right side, we have 2 times 1 plus sin A, 1 plus cos A, which need to be proved. So first of all, we compare 1 plus sin A as if it is A and cos A as if it is B, so that it can be compared with the formula A plus B whole square is equal to A square plus 2AB plus B square. Now we can write LHS as 1 plus sin A whole square in place of A square plus 2 times 1 plus sin A into cos A in place of 2 times AB and cos square A in place of B square. As we know, cos square A can be expressed in terms of sin A from one of its formulas that is cos square A is equal to 1 minus sin square A. So doing the same, we write first and second part as same. That is 1 plus sin A whole square plus 2 times 1 plus sin A into cos A. And we change this cos square A as 1 minus sin square A. Now, as we know, 1 can be given any power. So, when compared to sin square A here, we give the same power that is square to 1. Now this can be continued as 1 plus sine A whole square plus 2 times 1 plus sine A into cos A, all same from the above step. And here we convert this 1 square minus sine square A in the formula form that is a square minus b square is equal to a plus b into a minus b. So let's do the same here. Now 1 minus sine square a can be written as 1 plus sine a into 1 minus sine a. Now if we carefully observe all three parts in this step, we see 1 plus sine a is common in all. So let's take that that out common and write as 1 plus sine A in one bracket and in the remaining bracket we write 1 plus sine A remained in the first bracket so it will be same that is 1 plus sine A and from the second part, as 1 plus sine A has been already taken out as common, now there remains 2 and cos A, and we write that as 2 cos A here. In the same way, the last part, there will remain 1 minus sine A. So we'll write same here. Now in the second bracket, plus sine A and minus sine A can be cancelled, being equal value with opposite sign. Now we'll continue this as 1 plus sine A in the first bracket, that same. And when we add this one and this one, it will be 2 and plus and the remaining is 2 cos A. So we'll write 2 cos A here. Now in this second bracket, 
two is common. So let's take that two common out and we continue it as two first and the remaining is one plus sign a in the first bracket. So we'll write that same and in the second bracket S2 is already out. So here remains only one S2 into one is two plus now from two cos A, two is already out. So we'll write only cos A, which is same as RHS. Hence LHS and RHS are equal here. This is all in this video. Thank you for being the part of my channel. See you in the next video. Bye bye.